Welcome, folks. I'm Luke Boudreau, and I'm here with Eli Blukey and Isaac Kurzrock. So, guys, do you think that the, sh the Mets should be trading J.D. Mart Martinez? No. I 100% think they should, and the reason why is because he's 37 years old on a one-year contract, and in his last five or so games, he has, I think, maybe two hits. Also, he's old. The Mets are planning to rebuild for the future. We have so many good prospects, and we have a young squad. We, he's not really that big of an aspect to the team. If he's not, but he's also not big of a trade value, and he had, before those last five games, he has been hitting consistently. He's been getting singles, doubles, home runs. He has been a consistent hitter, and I think that the Mets do not have any reason to trade him. I think that they will trade somebody that is a part of the squad, but I do not think it will be J.D. I think they should trade J.D. for a good pitching prospect because we all know the Mets pitching has been absolutely horrific without Kodai Senga. He's still on the injured list coming back after the All-Star break. We all know that this team is pitching awfully, especially the bullpens. Well, I think that they should trade J.D. Martinez for maybe a couple good, solid bullpen young prospects. Right, but they could trade him any time this year. We're not ha we're not looking promising. We're not probably going to make a deep playoff run. We have no reason to make a trade, a big trade, right this second with J.D. Martinez. I think that we can keep J.D. until the end of the year, and then maybe after that we could do something, we could work some trades in. But I think that as of now, we have no reason to trade him away for a pitcher. But if we can get good value for him, you know, we could also throw Luis Severino in that deal because he's just on a one-year deal and he's been pitching fine but not as well. So if we, we throw him in with J.D. Martinez, I think we could get some good prospects in that package deal. I think you're wrong. We don't need prospects. Prospects, they could take how long could they take. We don't know how they're going to go. They could be in the minors for their whole career. We have no idea how they're going to turn out in the majors. They can come out of college number one prospect, best player in the league, and then they can come into the MLB and not perform because just the different aspects, the different atmospheres, they might not be able to adjust. I think that J.D. Martinez, he has adjusted, and he's proven time and time again that he could be a solid part in the squad. Well, thank you guys for your opinions. Now this is Luke Boudreau, Eli Blukey, and Isaac Kershaw signing off.